Hello, community. It's been a while. I haven't seen you in a while. Remember last year, February 2018? Blender 2.8, even though it was going, it was being worked on for like two years already, it was kind of slow. So in order to solve that, the Blender Foundation Blender prepared a code quest. So basically gathering every developer possible that we could afford, flying them in here to Amsterdam, to the Blender Studio, and make it happen, make 2.8 happen. Mainly like getting started, getting, because you don't have to have everyone here for so long. So even though it was three months, that's quite quite long uh, time, it was needed to get the 28 project started, collections, workspaces, you name it, everything. Since then, it actually worked quite well because since then, since uh, the end of the Cold Quest until now, has been so many things added, improved, um, the, the, yeah, basically the whole matcaps, HDRIs, community call for content, designs and redesigns and uh, new tools, new widgets, new, you, everything has been worked on. But there are a few little things that are left to be decided, that needs to be tweaked, and for that you really need to be together. So, announcing, well actually yesterday, the Blender the Blender, <laughs> Blender announced, Blender Odor announced the home stretch workshop. So it's one week or more, including the weekends, and you know how developers are crazy. So it's, it's, it's a, it, uh, one week, officially, of core developers here in Amsterdam to work on the remaining parts of 2.8, but mainly to, to, to meet and plan and define and schedule what's going to um, happen from now until the release of 2.8, 2.80, the first release. So where's the home stretch? Is a final stage, yeah, boring. I like this one better. The part of a race course between the last turn and the winning post. Yes. So in order to win 2.8, there will be um, um, over 12 developers here that are announced. Some of them are artists, like uh, Pablo Vasquez, you know, that guy. William Reinish is working on the interface. Don Rosenel for the big picture for, of Blender 2.8 and the design. Siren Stuvel working on Alembic and tools in general. Uh, Sergey Sharvin, dependency graph, pretty much everything, just like um, like Campbell is pretty much everything. Blender or Brecht also. Also interface and cycles. And Bastian for look, uh, asset management, translations, bunch of other stuff. Clement for EV. Dalai Felinto for collections, outliner, and general big picture also. Blender Shack, our man Jack, for everything nodes to plan it and also to, to see how to start with the project because this um, is not only for 2.80 release, but also the idea is to define the targets for 281, 282, and the comments. Yeroun, he was also part of the Blender uh, Gold Quest. He was working the workbench. Now he's working on OpenCL for... Um, uh, for better and faster cycle rendering. So that's pretty, pretty neat. So it's almost like a tiny code quest, but it's just going to happen um, here at the studio. So it's pretty much, actually, if you see the list of the code quests, it's just pretty much the same. But uh, by the way, you can still browse uh, the code quest page from last year, but um, it, it's there for legacy and nostalgia. But you can find actually uh, like Jack, which only joined for a brief uh, moment during the cold quest is now working full time here at the studio. You don't also so quite quite some improvements <laughs> since since then. So what can you expect? Well, you can expect videos. I'm gonna be making these kind of videos again. Um, um, there will be planning. That is like the big thing. The roadmap may basically is just just like uh, having a place where you can see okay what's gonna happen, when it's gonna happen, a better and a clearer picture of what is the release date, the release candidates. Remember the release cycles, first a test build, then a release candidate, one, two, until it gets very polished, and then the final release. But remember 2.80 is not the end of 2.8. There's 81, 82, and there's so many other projects lining up. So, so only good news. This video is only about good news. What do you have to do? Well. Just stay tuned, really. There's not a call for content for or call for anything, actually. It's just enjoy the magic happening for 2.8. Keep testing and keep reporting backs, please. And um, who's who's organizing this? Well, the development fund. If you're not already part of it, 
consider joining because this is um, possible thanks to all the awesome subscribers. You can, um, to the development fund, to the sponsors, and even the other sponsors that are not shown here, like silver and bronze. So everybody, thank you for making this happening, actually. Stay tuned for more news here at the Blender Developers um, Twitter, YouTube channel. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I will see you again very, 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 very soon. Ciao.